We got bait. <laughs> See if we can't get a little bit more of them. Oh, I hate catching bait in shallow water. Sketchy, sketchy. What's the thing on here? This a GoPro. Oh. I make YouTube videos. It's all right Are if I film. It? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yep, you know you're shallow when there's paddle boarders offshore of you. Warren! We're just out here fishing for fun. Yeah, that's right. Thank you. All right, girls, let's go fishing. Well, that was super fun catching bait in five feet of water. It's weird having surfers be further offshore than you when you're catching bait. Not ideal. Luckily, there's no waves today. So, but what is going on, guys? Jovi T here. We have an interesting deal today. So. A group of seven chartered us out. We can only take six on each boat, so we broke them up. I got the girls, and Jeff and Chad have the boys. So we got a little bit of friendly family competition here. So we're going to try to outfit the boys today. We're going to try to make it happen here. Just load it up. Bait was kind of annoying to get today. We have to go super far south, but we're going to try to catch them up. We're going to see what happens. We are out here, and it's very foggy, if you couldn't tell. There's about six or seven boats in this area, and we can only see two right now. A little bit sketchy, but I wish I had a radar. That's what I wish I had. Chad, talking to you. Radar, radar. People are catching them. So we're just waiting for the bite. I'm about to roll up on the spot right here. See what happens. You can do it. What do I do? I can't do it. You see that handle there? You got to turn it. Which way? <laughs> Which way? It you want to turn it that way? That there way! You I gotta go. come up with fence! <laughs> turn it the other way! <laughs> oh my god! That's a pretty good fish on right here. Hi. Oh, you can do it. I have faith in that. Just look at the left hand in front of the reel, you get better left. There you go. Keep it coming, girl. <laughs> gotta beat the boys. Come on. My hands tired. <laughs> you got it. Here, keep that rod out. Keep on reeling. You got it. Uh oh. He may have just gotten eaten. There you go. Real, real. Oh. Uh, oh, all right. Come on back here. <laughs> oh, my hands. You got it. Okay, what you're going to do, you're going to lift and then you're going to reel down to it. Here, lift it all the way up and then start turning the handle now. There you go. Lift. Nice and easy on the lift. There you go. Almost got him. Here, keep that rod out. Keep that rod out. Gotta keep, oh, keep it off the boat, keep it off the boat. He's gonna swing around. Here, put the rod, put the rod down. Put the rod down in the, no, 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 hold on to it. Sorry, put the rod tip down. All right, keep on reeling. You almost got him. See what we got. Nice kingfish. Oh, wow. Yep. Oh my God. Nope. There you go. Wow. Ow. There you go. Break your thumb. Ooh, that hurt. <laughs> nice king for start of the day right there. I'll take it. Good start. Oh, down there. There you go. Who wants this one? Woo! I got a streamer, folks. <laughs> Alright, how about I'm gonna wait, just keep on letting him run. Keep on reeling. Hold on, wait. Reel down to him. Ready? Reel? Yeah. Slow lift. There you go. Keep Try to keep that rod tip down. Oh, reel, reel, reel. Oh, he's up there now. Whoa! He just shot forward. That was so cool. Oh my goodness. Did you see that? He swam all the way up forward. Squirrely kingfish. There, it's a nice one. Oh, he's getting chased. That's probably why. Here. Reel, 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 reel. Nice fish. Here. There you go. He's probably getting chased by the tax man. Out of way, girls. Man, you guys gotta be getting bigger fish than the boys right now. Out of way, Sophie. Yeah, girl. That's a nice kingfish right there. Yeah. Oh, we're gonna be beating the boys. You guys keep this up. We're beating the boys for sure. Yeah, solid grade right there. We're gonna beat the boys. Jesus, that's huge. <laughs> 
<laughs> we gonna beat the boys, that's for sure. Getting hot now. Um, oh, right here. There you go. Look at that run. The other good one. Yes. Come on. Come on, Miss Amy. Oh. What's going on here? Going at the boat. Somebody got. Oh, he's here. Here, keep tight on him. There you go. There you go. Oh. Yeah, he doesn't like the boat. Can I get you to step forward just a little bit, Amy? Up towards the step there. A little bit more, a little bit more, please. There you go. Perfect. Oh, <laughs> you all right? <laughs> Didn't mean to scare you. <laughs> Out of the way, girls. <laughs> there you go. Now you have. Nice, 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 nice. Here's the other group. I'm gonna say hello. Hey! Knock it off! No, evil! Hey, it actually helps me out. Thanks for telling it for me. Oh my god! You're horrible people. Oh, we got two. I got three! Yeah, we're beating the boys. We're beating them. Hey, we're beating them, girls. Yay! Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Richard! Hey, buddy! You've seen him in my videos before. That's old Richard with old chicken bone, all these board charters. Picking through the kings, dodging sharks. These guys are having a really bad problem with uh, big sharks and barracuda today. Um, luckily, we're kind of staying away from the group, and we haven't had that issue yet, which is good, considering we've hooked bigger fish. And taking them, taking a little bit longer than usual to get them in, and we're not getting taxed. So I'm gonna stay in this area because it's clearly a good grade, and none of the man in the suit. So I'm gonna stick where I am. Sounds like a game plan. There's downrigger. There he goes. He wants him. There you go. Let him run if he wants to. Oh, here do long lifts, and then get ready to reel. Reel down. There you go. Perfect. And reel down. Perfect. All right, one, two, oh, what's, oh God, don't go, fish, don't go. <laughs> yeah, second sharky. There you go. Wow, that's Reamer. That's a good one right here. Who wants it? There you go. There you go, keep on reeling. Yeah. Keep it going, girl. There you go, keep it going. Come on, mama. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Hey. Whoa. <laughs> Here he goes. Oh, there's a shark chasing it. Oh boy. Oh boy, we got sharks chasing it. Keep on reeling, keep on reeling. Keep it tight before Jaws gets him. Oh, man. Oh. I can't, I can't. You got it, you got it, you're all right. Here you go, now we're real, real. Come on, Amy, you got him. Keep on reeling. Here, keep it out. Keep it off the boat. Keep it off the boat. Oh, keep it out. Keep it out. Keep it down. Rot tip down. Rot tip down. Keep it down. Keep rot tip down. Oh, God. We got to go around. Here, let me see it. We got to go around. All the way around. Woo. All right, just come on this side. Yeah. Here you go. Perfect. Right here. Atta a girl. Oh, we just got eaten, I think. Oh, yeah. Oh, he just got eaten. Maybe not. Try to keep that rod out. You see it? I'm gonna go around. Oh, round and round. Here he comes, straight to Papa. Come here. Come here, Shimey. Nice fish. Out of way. Yeah. <laughs> really? You didn't know you're gonna do laps around the boat. Get some cardio in, girl. Come on. That's a chunky mackerel right there. Chunky. Keep on reeling. Coming right to us. Look at him on the surface there. Oh, come here, Bubba. 
Nice kingfish. Nice one. Nice one, girls. Yeah. Nice fish. Oh my God, worth the pain. Worth the pain, girl. Yeah. That's got to be right there. I think we beat the boys with this one right here. Yep, solid 25 pounder. Come on, girl. Oh Give me some God. high fives, girls. Giving it to them. Yeah. <laughs> That's a winner right there. Well, That's a good grade of kings right here. You guys are lighting the world on fire now. This is probably the biggest grade of fish I've had in a while. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't gonna get you. Well, see, I'm a king mackerel. Nice fish, girls. <laughs> Yeah, well, he ain't done nothing, man. It's been super slow. Rushed another boat over here, catch two or three of them. Yeah, that even makes it worse. Yeah, tell me about it. There you go, that's him. Double. Come on, now. Oh, easy. Who wants it? Who wants it? Come on away from this guy. Keep it tight, keep it tight. Rear row. Put three in the boat. There you go. The girls on a double. Come on now, girls. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep that rod, try to keep that rod out. Keep that rod to the right. There you go. Perfect. Easy. Out of the way, guys. Two fish going two separate ways. All right. <laughs> you all right? Here, careful. You, you see him up there? Keep on reeling. Yeah, I'll watch them. Alrighty. Nice and easy reel. Nice and easy reel. There you go. There he is. Nice fish there, Amy. Another nice king. All right. Come on. <laughs> no, you got it. You got it. He's almost there. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Oh god. <laughs> Sorry. Big lift. Alrighty. There you go. Out of way, Amy. Toughed it out here. Here, come around. Or just stay right there actually. Right. Keep on going. Nice. Ah. You need to get a smaller gaff. Come here, fish. There we go. Oh, Out of way, girls. Woohoo! Double twubble. Oh, You're done, Amy? I can't do it. <laughs> Woo! Another double for the girls. Yeah. <laughs> we might have our limit, guys. I don't know. We have to check it. Look at that. Look at that spitting up all the chum I've been throwing. You think chum doesn't work? You think? I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but you guys are throwing up on full speed. Guys are about to be gaffed. Chum works, folks. Chum works. We need one more. Come on, fish. We need one more. They keep on boiling on our baits. Oh, you see that one, Sky? I wonder if that's on our bait. Do you see them Sky down our chum out there? Well. Give it a shot. There we go. Come on. Come on. There you go. That's a good one right here. There you go. How do we girl? There you go. Let him run. Oh, look at that guy. Big sandbar. Keep on reeling. Oh, it's a cobia. Eat it. Come here, Amy, 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 come here. Got a cobia. Keep on reeling. Keep on reeling. Oh, oh, he came off. Come around the engine, come around the engine. Come around, come on, come on around. Keep on coming. Keep on coming. Here, here. Okay, come on back around. Come on back around. Come on. 
You got it. Step forward. Step forward. Step forward. Come on. Big lift. Big lift. There you go. That's the way to finish the day right there. Oh, man. This boat was so clean. I had the boat so clean. Kobe had to ruin it. Oh, well. Hey, that's better than a limited king. We got, well, we got seven nice kings and finish the day off with a Cobia. It's a pretty good day, if you ask me, for a four-hour trip. Woo! You guys got a nice one there. How about that? We're gonna have to, hey, we got a competition going. I don't know if you guys, like, are a part of this competition, but we've been competing with y'all all day. We have a couple nice fish, too. Oh, we're gonna have to do a three-fish aggregate. This might be a close one. Girls, it's gonna be close. <laughs> it's gonna be real close, girls. I think we still got them, though. I think we still got them. We got a good grade of fish. <laughs> Alright, let's clean up a little bit. Alrighty, offload time. Man, we definitely beat those dudes. I know we did. Well, you may be wondering why I look a little bit wet right now. I'm gonna pretend like I didn't just drop that cobia in the water and had to go swim after it. Slippery, slimy. <laughs> but hey, we got it. We got it. I caught that same cobia twice today. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. We got them though. <laughs> so who won? Let's get you two. Y'all's two. I want to do two or three biggest fish. Uh, we got y'all. I don't see nothing in there. So press it. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. We'll see about that. Let's see. Let's do two biggest. Yeah, I think you. Well, I don't know. It's gonna be. Close. I don't know. Cause this one's bigger, but this this is the biggest one, but this is the smallest one. But these are two, kind of the same size. They're pretty good. All right, we're gonna get them to all hold them up for a group mm. picture. I'm gonna have to give it to the boys. I might have to. Barely though. Uh, he let we, them. They had three people. <laughs> yeah, that's it. He let them hold the fish by the tail for yeah. a picture. Well, I got a different kind of picture. I traumatized Amy right here, trying to hold the Kobe by the gills. She about passed out when I asked her to do it. I traumatized her. All right, we're gonna get a group picture here. Nice work, guys. Double teaming them up with the charter. Ends up for a pretty good day. You guys crushed them. Pretty good for a couple four hour charters. Well there you have it right there. Chad here is filleting one of these kingfish. Oh, he's got more in them. That's all that chum, all those chummers I was throwing out. Full speed, that's probably one of the last ones we caught. You tell me that chum doesn't work. Eat old brown fish, Koya. One of my least favorite fish to clean. It's, uh, it's a good tasting fish. No bloodline. The rule with Kobe is no bloodline. If you leave bloodline in there, it's going to taste like cheeks. But anyways, these things like to roll around a lot. You, you just kind of have to pin them up sometimes, you'll see. So you just pin it right there, just like that. Just like most big fish, just ride all the way down with backbone right there. So all the way down, cut through. Start on the way back, just right here. Go all the way, see they're trying to roll me. Gotta pin them. Go all the way back down. Right there. And now you see this right here. You just wanna kinda of go over the backbone right there. And you can just push all the way through. And just cut down. And you can either roll the rib cage or you can keep it in and cut it out. The ribs are actually really good grilled. But I'm gonna do ribs in for this. So once you got this, bring it off a little bit. I'm gonna go down either side of its lateral line right here. And then push it through, hold it up, just go, oh, go straight down, just like that. And cut it all the way through. Just come here and you skin it just like a regular fish. Yeah, sure. 
All right, and the main thing about this is the bloodline. The bloodline is gonna ruin this fish, so. Luckily, Kobe, you're a big fish, so you're not losing a whole lot of meat, you know, making sure all those bloodlines trimmed out. It really makes a huge difference in the quality of the meat. So make sure you get all of it. I always do. I'm a big quantity, or I'm, excuse me, I'm a big quality over quantity guy. Isn't that right, Richard? All right. Same thing on this side. Come all the way down. You can cut this rib cage right out of here. This is all bloodline right here, so you can top that. And same thing, you're just going to trim it up. And you got your ribs. These are really good on the grill. And uh, the pin bones will come right out of this. Just grill it up. I have a video of that. I'll link that in the description of grilling some of these ribs. It's really, really awesome. And uh, yeah, that's your, there's your cobia, guys. That's how you clean it. <laughs> Grilled king mackerel. Uh, not a huge fan of kingfish, but I actually had some yesterday for lunch, and it's really not as bad as I remember it. But we're going to grill it. I got the coals going out there. Really easy. Just going to wrap her in tin foil right here. Put some olive oil on it. Chef Paul. Easy as that. Put her on the grill. That's what we do on this channel. We do easy stuff, but it's really good easy stuff. So we're about to make her happen. Like I said, just a hair, a little bit of olive oil. And we're going to mix it around. Get it all over each filet. All right, Chef Paul. I like a lot of Chef Paul. I like me some spices. Put the other, oop, oh, one more right there. Flip her over, do the other side. She ready for the grill, y'all. She ready for the grill. All right, so we got it on the grill. And I was gonna cover it, but I kinda like the smokiness that's coming out of here, so I think I'm just gonna leave it open and uh, just flip it. So we're waiting. Just put her on, I'm gonna close the lid, see how it goes. All righty, how we looking? I'm pretty damn good right here. Hmm. Flip her real quick. Looking good. Oh man, I kind of messed that up. I'm all kind of stuck to the tin foils. What happened? Yeah, it's kind of sticking. I don't know. Well, actually, I'm going to leave this one unflipped and see how that goes. And these two are thicker. I don't know, I kind of wish I covered it now because it looks like it's drying out a little bit. You can kind of see how it's drying out, but it doesn't look that bad. I'm gonna give it a couple more minutes. All right, I'm looking done. I think this piece looks pretty done too. Just kind of open it up. I'm gonna open it up and check it. Oh yeah, it's cooked all the way through. Maybe I didn't have to turn those other pieces either. It's pretty hot in this grill. Yeah, we're gonna give it a try here, guys. All right, so it's looking pretty good here. I'm gonna try the uh, one of the pieces that I flipped over first. It's still pretty moist, even though it doesn't look it. This, that's pretty good, actually. Kingfish is pretty underrated, in my opinion. I mean, a lot of people like it, but it's not necessarily something that you are sought after, like grouper snapper, but... Mmm. No, this piece looked pretty dry. It's kind of dry, but it's not bad. And here's the piece that I didn't flip. That's pretty damn good there. I kind of wish I didn't flip the other two. It's really, really moist on top. That's, that's some fish right there. Well, yeah, there you go. There's some black and kingfish on the grill. Guys, if you like this video, subscribe, like, leave a comment, give me cooking tips. I'm not great at cooking, but I'm on this journey with you. If you want to come fish with me, go to teambuckrogers.com. We do four to 12 hour charters, and uh, we'd love to come see you, and I'd love to make a video with you. Guys, I will see you next time. Love y'all.